So for today we're going to be doing stationary RNG or legendaries. Um, this works for fossils, um, the Hitmons, Snorlax, Lapras. Um, I'm going to be doing actual stationary Pokemon because um, the encounters, because they vary a different and they involve a little bit of tweaking. So make sure to download the pack in the description and you're going to supply your own ROM and get your save. Make sure you are saved outside of the power plant. And that's all you need. Um, the pack, your save, perfect. So the first thing we're going to do is open our save in PK Hex and we're going to open PokeFinder as well. So we're going to go into PokeFinder. We're going to go into stationary tab under Gen 3. We're going to hit manager. We're going to hit new and we're going to leave this here. Then we're going to go into PK Hex, into the save. Oh, sorry. We actually haven't opened the save. That would be helpful. Uh, select fire red go into save you can see there's all our pokemon legit um we're going to go into trainer info and we're just going to copy and paste the trainer id and the secret id i've already done that as you can see it's right here so i don't need to do that then in this drop down it'll have all your profiles or uh yeah so that's all we need for now so on vbarr which is the emulator inside the pack you have to use this emulator so we're going to hit browse oh i'll show you guys again um tools new scripting new loose script window hit browse hit gen 3 stat display dot lua and then boom you're going to have this here so um first thing you want to do is load up the save and you're going to hit 9 when stat display is up. And that will change from your team to enemy team. 8, eight will change the number of the Pokemon. So we can check our Growlithe, our Oddish, all that good stuff. So what we want to do is just do a test run. And check when the stats come up. So the stats come up here. Some Pokemon, it will be on this window. And then you'll press A again. And then the stats will come up. So we know that. Another thing we need to go into is tools, debug, memory viewer, oh, memory viewer, <laughs> not map viewer. <laughs> um, then we're going to hit into this box, make sure 18 or 16 bit is selected, 2-0, oh, so four O's. And then as you see there, all this changed and this gives us our seed that we're going to be using. So what I want to do is hit P, control P, that pauses, and we're going to type this into PK hex. So mine is 60CE, yours is going to be completely different. 60CE, hit generate, and there is all the Pokemon we can get. Now we're going to click shiny, and boom. Um, I want to go for this timid. Ooh, is timid good? Hmm. It's 31. Hmm. I have to look this up real quick. Sorry about that. I forget. It's t I forget my nature is. I get timid and jolly mixed up a lot. Um. Is that just nature? Mm hmm. You want modest? Or timid, yeah. So we're going to go for this one. So we're going to hit control P again and we're going to let this run. So while this runs, I'm going to explain a few things and a few controls. So we're going to get the calculator out. We're going to need that later to calculate our delay, which a delay um, builds up throughout the save or how long it's going. So how many frames you build up right in this little counter right here. Um, it'll show it'll uh, build up so we're going to type in target and console control c is to copy i haven't i don't think i've mentioned that that's just basic uh computer commands but hey some people might not know or you can just right click and hit copy to txt oh that copies the save or the actual thing cv yeah no mm. okay they're files so you can't actually do it so you have to do control c i thought you could 
So we're gonna wait until 40,000. We're gonna hold on the space bar. Let this just go on. Um, another commands are control P. I already went through that. And then control N is to advance single frame. So we'll be using that to be precise. Um, hmm, I'm thinking, should I just go for this impish one? Nah, I only have a master ball on me. So I'll be right back once I'm done this, but um, so we're back. We're gonna hit control P, pause. And then we're gonna hit shift F1 to save state. So we have the save one written down there. So we're gonna do 40211 or whatever um, frame you're on. This is just a test run. So we're gonna see, hopefully this isn't past too much. And we can just type in these IVs if we want. Hey, we'll encounter it for fun. So we're gonna type 29, 29, 2, 2, 15, 15, 30, 30. Oh, sorry. Um, the layout is different, and I do this from time to time. I mentioned this in all my tutorials. So sp speed is here, and speed is here. So you're going to skip that. Um, do 11, 11, 30, 30. This is actually a pretty bad one. <laughs> um, oh, and we're way behind. Okay, that that's a huge delay. So rule of thumb. Um, when you minus the delay, if it's a positive, you add it. If it's a negative, you subtract it. And if that doesn't work for you, you just um, do the opposite. So, if that makes sense. So, say if this doesn't work for me, I'll subtract it and see if that works. If not, hey. So, we're going to go up 4,000 frames. We're going to speed up here. Do, 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 do. And when we get to 4-4... Four, four, um, 44,000 we're gonna pause boom and then we're gonna hit control n and go up these frames gradually make sure not to miss them <laughs> um, and we're gonna save this as our second save so we can go back in time so say if we mess this up completely we can go back here but we're probably not oh we did mess it up Hmm. Perfect. I can show you this again. So, this happens every now and again. It's perfectly okay. And we just redo the process. It actually hasn't happened to me in most of these tutorials, so that's good. So just fill in all of them again. Boom. Um, oh, and we did go over. Damn. So, we gotta subtract this. This from this, and we know to add it, because we're close to the frame. So, our delay actually decreased. That's perfectly fine. So we gotta speed up again, do, 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 do. And this is pretty much the process. You want to do this over and over again. Um, sometimes, sometimes it gets really frustrating. I'll be honest. Um, but it's very simple. Much easier than retail. I think that's it. Yep. Boom. There we go. Um, we are. Yeah, I saw the perfect special attack. And what I like to do, just for these videos, we're going to hold A. We're going to wait for this to do, do, do boom, then control alt print screen. Ooh, I messed that up. <laughs> uh, there we go. Got a little shiny frame there. Boom. So like, comment, subscribe. Um, and hope to see you guys in my next video where I do roamers. Actually, hey, hey, just for a little bonus, we'll master ball it. Hey. <laughs>